What's going on everyone? Hope you're having an amazing day today and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking about the Opinicus volume data script. This was a custom script built by the Opinicus team specifically for the Thinkorswim platform. If you're new to the channel, my name is Kyle and this is Opinicus Holdings. Now, as we know, there are only two absolutes in trading, one of them being price and the other volume. So volume is very important to us as day traders. As Thinkorswim comes in its kind of bare bones form, we have the ability to bring volume off the main chart, bring it down here, which is very helpful. It gives us an idea. It gives us a more clear idea of what's happening with volume in terms of it's a, if if the current day is a high volume day, low volume day, if we're seeing certain spike, spikes like this, which we saw on this particular day. However, the data that is provided is still fairly limited. We don't know, for instance, on the most recent day of trading, we don't know how that day compares to the normal average of volume. We don't know how many shares were traded upon quick glance. We have to actually go put our mouse over this and then we can we can get a feel for what the volume looks like using this little pop-up right here that you see me highlighting with the mouse. And it's kind of cumbersome to be looking at volume in this method and try and kind of get a quick idea of how the day is looking, what the particular bar in terms of which time frame we're looking at is looking like. So if we're at the four hour, you know, each one of these is gonna be an individual bar. And so we created this script that has previously only been available to members of the Opinicus team and we have decided to make it public. Now I'm gonna show you what that looks like and then to actually download the script, it's entirely free. Just go to the link in the description below and you'll be able to download it and load it into your Thinkorswim platform. I don't know if it's compatible with other brokers. If they have the ability to load scripts, whatever broker you may be using, broker platform, you can go ahead and try it out, but I, I can't guarantee that it's going to work. This was designed specifically for Thinkorswim. So once you actually get the link to download it and load it into your into your platform here, what you're going to want to do is you'll quickly go up to studies, add study, and then we'll go to user defined and it'll be right there, say Opinicus volume data. What's going to pop up? You're going to have this little pop up right here. Now, what are we looking at? So we've got five boxes that are displayed. From left to right, we've got daily average. That's gonna tell you exactly how many shares are traded as an average over the last 30 days. So it is limited to the last 30 days. I kind of wanted to have something that was more relevant to what's been happening with price action in you know, recent days and weeks as opposed to from the IPO of the particular company. So it is drawn from the last 30 days, keep that in mind. So this is the daily average. We've got 17.2 million over the last 30 days is the daily average here on Facebook. Today, that's gonna tell you how many shares were traded today. And so right now it's 13.4 million. That is only the percentage, that is 78% of what the daily average is. So this, of course, the percentage is gonna change with whatever ticker you're actually looking at. We've got Costco here, 88%. If we go to Visa, so it shows 134%. And as you can see, when today's volume goes higher than the daily average, the box will actually change colors and it turns to yellow. We also see that the percentage turns to yellow as well. And so average bar, moving on from those boxes average bar tells us what the average bar is for the particular time frame we're looking at and so that's going to that's going to change pretty widely depending on if we're looking at the hourly right you've got an average average hourly bar on visa here of 991,000 shares and compared to the 4 hour we've got an average bar of 2.2 million so you can see the distinction there of average bar um, again that's that's pulled from the from the last, I think it's the last 30 total bars. It may be more than that. I can't remember exactly. I need to check the script on that. 
And then the current bar, that should be pretty obvious. That's just the current trading bar. Now on Visa, it shows 460. That's because you know it's, it's telling us what this after hours bar has done. So you could get a quick feel for what the current bar is, whatever time frame you're looking at, whether you're looking at, you know, the five minute here on Visa, you can get a feel for each individual bar. Um, and it's very, very easy to use at a quick glance. You don't have to highlight these individual bars with your mouse and try and get a feel for what the volume is looking like. You can know exactly if this particular stock is higher than average volume, if it's about on par with average or or you know way way above average for example we had gbr i don't trade this name but i did see it online was trading with super huge volume uh, looks like some type of uh, penny stock that was pumped up and we see that it was traded at twelve thousand percent of what the daily average is and so when you get when you get a high enough percentage i believe it's set to 200 percent these boxes will actually turn green so kind of, again, just another useful tool for you to use with your Thinkorswim platform to get a quick, very quick idea of what's happening with volume. Now, this is important to me as a day trader because I want to be where the volume is. I want to be where the activity is. And so if I'm able to quickly just scan through my entire watch list and, and, and see this tool here and how it's looking, then I can get a feel for what names I'm going to be wanting to trade. Again, if you guys want to download this, it's totally free. Link down below in the description box. As always, if you got any value from this video, if you enjoy the, the volume uh, script tool, please drop a subscribe on the channel and like this video so it reaches more people. Enjoy the rest of your day and I will see you in the next video. Thank you.